Hey, Dad Random here, and I have the Air 3 in my hands, and we're going to give you a midterm review of the performance of the Air 3, and we're gonna fly in this most beautiful location. This is probably the most gorgeous, and we are in Hurricane Hillary. Dad Random flying the Air 3 in a hurricane. Yes, we're gonna get her done, and this thing is going to take care of us while we do it. All right, Dad Random. Air 3, yeah. Hey, this is Dad Random. Um, it's been a while since I last um, last discussed the Air Three because uh, it's you know of course the time has gone gone by since it first uh, was introduced into the market. Um, a lot of people are asking, hey, is this going to be the only uh, the only drone of this type? Uh, is there going to be a follow up version of it? So I decided to uh, to do a flight. I um, mean, talk a little bit about um, the future of the uh, DJI Air 3. So, so yeah, and I decided that this would be the perfect time. I would fly in a hurricane. Uh, so I guess some people were saying that uh, Hurricane Hillary was going to be going by. Well, I'm in the middle of it right now. So I guess if this is Hurricane Hillary, uh, uh, she's uh, a little bit disappointing. Um, but I have the Air 3, uh, and we're going to go ahead and uh, fly in a hurricane and then talk a little bit about the long-term review of this. Is, is, the, um, is the DJI Air 3, uh, is it something that you would like to uh, purchase uh, uh, within, uh, you know, within the next uh, three months, uh, within the next six months? Is this going to be replaced, I guess, by another, uh, another version? Uh, my guess is, in my in my my belief is no. So, but so I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and get flying. All right, here we go. So, Dad, random uh, long term review. Uh, a lot of people uh, uh, flew it uh, quickly and then they just kind of discarded it. And, and yes, this is probably one of the most amazing um, products that have, have come out of the DJI Labs. Uh, in a long time, really simple to set up. Um, I've already I've already ready to go here. Um, super awesome video quality. Uh, typical DJI stuff. Um, you can't. We don't. We've come to expect nothing less. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and launch, and we're gonna take a little flight. And um, as we go, um, discuss the future of the Air Three. And like every. Uh, DJ, DJI drone ever. Um, absolutely amazing. So I am at a really beautiful spot. I love to fly here. Uh, so let's go ahead and uh, as we are enjoying the scenery, let's fly the Air 3. So as, as far as taking off and the controller, um, well, let's get, let's move this out. Let's go ahead and then yeah, we're, we're, we're recording. As far as the, the RC2, the RC2 is definitely a huge step up without a doubt. Um, there was nothing that kept me from launching this. It's probably, we probably got seven to 10. Um, probably at altitude, we're gonna have 10 to 15 mile an hour winds. So let's go ahead and, and we are gonna stay in normal mode. And wow, and, and like I said, every time I put this bird in the air, it just, all it does is it just reminds me of how, how easy the hobby has become, you know, and DJI has kind of made us spoiled. Um, I really love this spot because I get dynamic clouds. So this uh, this spot is going to uh, enhance our our uh, our video, and we get a lot of a lot of textures here for the camera. So do I lose anything? You know, is if if this is uh, you know this is a replacement for. Uh, the air, wow, air, there you go. There's some of the breeze. I told you, it's Hurricane Hillary um, going through California and, and hitting us right now. Uh, there's weather all over the place. You can see the, the cloud dynamics. You can see that there's a lot of, there's blue there, but let me tell you something, there's rain and the, there's rain in them clouds. But um, yeah, I don't, I don't feel like I've lost anything. 
when it's come to the video of this. I really don't. I think I think a lot of people were th were uh, expecting this to be a dud, you know. And uh, by no means is this uh, flight platform anything but as good as every DJI product ever came out. So not the number one uh, the number one thing I would say camera wise is we don't lose anything. I can see the dynamic in the sky. I can see the edges of the clouds. There, there, there's there's texture in the clouds, and whatever um, movie magic or whatever cinemagic that DJI is putting into their uh, their photography um, portion of their you know of their uh, their their products is just absolutely it's phenomenal. There's just no. Uh, there's no getting by that. I, you know, people want this to be a failure, and it's just not. Uh, if you have, if you have the uh, the DJI Air 2S, um, yeah, you're gonna have you're gonna have a a sensor advantage for sure. But look at that. I'm gonna I'm bu I'm buzzing up um, to the top of that corner over there, and not missing a beat i am in uh, now i should be going i should be flying with the with the wind here and look at that look at the texture look at the dynamics of that scenery it just doesn't disappoint and i'm flying in like i said probably 10 to 15 mile an hour winds a lot of you guys don't think it's a big deal, but try to get your uh, try to get your mini uh, your mini three up here and tell me how how your flight goes. It might even be a sustained fifteen at this point. I might even be uh, flying uh, some fifteen mile an hour sustained winds. Look at that! That is just it's glorious. Now I'm going to fly all the way to the end of this uh, this portion and drop the. I'm trying to get as much sky as possible because you just if you're not getting sky today, you're oh a little break up there. It's a little bit of break up. Break up. There's some more. There's some more break up. I'm getting some RC interference. A uh, little bit of remote controller. Now we got it. Okay, no, no transmission. Okay, it's going into return to home. So we've lost connection. And we are waiting for a signal. So I've lost, I lost connection. And I'm waiting for a, okay. And there it is. So that's complete loss of signal. And recovery. So the drone right now is saying it's strong winds. It's, uh, it's, it's, it's in control of the flight back. And as you can see, you can see what it's seeing. I'm gonna go ahead and shut off the return. And that's why you buy this, guys. That's, that, is, that is something that comes uh, prepackaged with this drone, which is a complete um, uh, auto autonomy. So you go ahead and we'll put that uh, camera down there. I don't have the I don't have the uh, exposure locked in, so we're getting all kinds of crazy stuff. Let's go ahead and get that. Let's get the. There we go. A little bit, a little bit bright there. Um. So yeah. Let's go ahead and shut down. All. And. My EV is at one. I'm going to drop it down to zero. 
there we go that's probably that's a little bit better and um, let's go ahead and take it this way we're at 54 percent um, we just lost connection and we're going to continue with our flight uh, at 54 percent um, the reason why I'm going to continue is because even though I've um, I'm at 54 percent 54 percent is probably I don't know five miles and I'm gonna drop it down we'll get uh, get low look at the look at look at in the distance look at out there look at the sky look at the sky dynamics it is just spectacular way off in the distance there And just a second, I'm going to turn it in. Like I said, we've got uh, plenty of uh, plenty of, of battery power. It is, like I said, it is fighting the wind. Though we're going 26 miles an hour on the wind. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, look at that sky out there. Wow, that is just so cool. It, there's nothing better than flying in the wind in a storm, in a hurricane. So we are flying a drone in a hurricane. Look at the sky out there. That is just absolutely amazing. I'm just trying to trying to be slow. They really don't need to be in a hurry. Stay, stay away from that road. I really I try to stay away from roads as much as possible. But uh, wow, complete loss of signal. and no worry at all whatsoever um so is this thing going to is this is this a better drone than the air 2s uh in 2023 um, i would say as far as technology is concerned you only you only can do better with new technology very rarely do you go do you take a step backwards when you go to another generation of of a, of a product, even if you know, even if um, in your you know from your expertise, you're you know not gaining something uh, such as a larger ca uh, camera sensor. Um, what you're gaining with this is you're gaining um, another year of of obstacle avoidance technology. You're gaining another year of connectivity, another year of uh, upgrades in the controller. You're gaining another year of, of color science, better understanding of, of uh, the environment that uh, drones fly in, um, upgraded safety features. So like I said, I can't, I can keep going on and on at what you'll gain, you know. And, uh, much more safety, uh, or that much more safety. So we're almost back in. It's 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 fighting it's fighting the wind at this point just a little bit. And um, yeah, we're coming in, coming in like a champ, like it is. It is the champion of drones. And there she is, quiet too. Gosh, this quiet. Uh, you got another year of. Of, of, of basically DJI perfecting their propellers, um, perf perfecting their obstacle avoidance. But so on this flight, we started with half a battery. We're flying in a lot of wind. We lost connectivity. The drone was probably flying on its own for about a minute and a half, two minutes. Um, maybe it felt like a minute and a half and two minutes. Like a hundred years. I held down that down, that down stick, I swear, for a hundred years. It just feels like that every time I do that. Go ahead and shut that down. Um, so... 
Are you better off uh, updating your uh, your technology and going with the Air 3 after uh, you know over a year and a half of uh, of another drone release? You understand when the Air when the Air 3 was being developed, this was probably three years ago when the Air 2S was being developed. So you know we were talking about a lot of time when it comes to development, and as that you know as that time progresses. You, you probably are getting in development, you're probably getting over three years of, of, uh, of technological moves forward when you go up a generation. Because you got to remember, this thing was being developed a while back, you know, at least two years ago. Um, and, you know, this thing was, you know, they were design, they were looking at the body design, they were uh, experimenting with what they already had in the Air 2, and they were already creating what the future would be with the camera, the lighter camera, the multiple camera uh, modules. Um, so this thing is a quantum leap forward. So quite literally, you know, just taking this step is really making, uh, like I said, your flight safer. It's making your, uh, your, uh, your videography that much better. Camera use is easier. Um, the safety features, all of the things that go into uh, a, uh, an upgraded platform are brought to you when you when you move forward with the Air 2S. So yeah, I am. Uh, what I what I want to go backwards uh, and and fly in you know an Air 2S? No, not even guys. You no. So so yeah, Dad. Random. Um, I would say after after the. Uh, the uh, the three or four months has it been three or three months the three months since this has been out um, I can only still smile uh, and I always know I'm ready anytime it's windy anytime the light is affecting uh, my shot anytime I uh, need to just quickly get it in the air it's always ready to go so all right dead random uh, for the long-term review of the DJI Air 2S, I would say midterm review. I wouldn't say this is long term. For the midterm review of the uh, DJI Air 2S, absolutely a huge yes.